Hi guys, so today I'm going to be doing a retry of a product to see if it will take out this purple um, because it did take out blue. product I'm talking about is the L'Oreal Episol Color Remover. Um, this is basically bleach, kind of. Um, so you have the option of mixing it with water or developer. I used water last time and it worked really well, so I don't want to put developer in it because I'm trying to avoid that. But this is what it looks like. Um, I did make a video on it already. It should be up, but it took out blue probably in 10 minutes. So I'm trying to see if it will take out purple. Um, so this is Riot or Ritual. It's Ritual by Arctic Fox and it's super faded. And my roots are terrible, so I'm gonna try this on this. Um, this is supposed to be professional use only. Um, so if you go to salads, you have to have a professional ID. Or you can have people who are hairstylists in your life and they'll do it. So I'm gonna do it with the warm water. I have warm water right there. I know it's gonna measure it though, because I had to do two ounces. So it's two ounces of water to one packet of this. So this is probably gonna be too much. Um, and I really hope it works, so I don't want to have to go get another one. Um, so there's that. So I'm just going to open it. So it's just two ounces of... So if you're using water, it's just two ounces. And if you're using developer, it's two and a half ounces of 20 volume. So we're using water, so don't make the mistake like I did last time. I smelt it. Don't do that. It's... No. Alright, so I'm just going to mix it in here. Oh, fuck. I don't think I have a brush up here. Ooh. So, um... <coughs> it's so bad. Um, I don't have my hair dressing brush, so... I'm just gonna mix it with a, um... Hair scissors. Oh, I feel like there's too much water on there. water in here. I don't know what else to do about that. Um, yeah, so I don't have a method to anything I do. I'm just gonna put it on my head. It's so watery. I think I fucked up. I think I fucked up real bad. Don't do anything I do. This is in a tutorial.
So, this is what it's looking like right now. This isn't a tutorial, don't do what I do because I do nothing correctly. But as you can tell, it's kind of faded already. Um, max time you're supposed to leave it in is 20 minutes. Oh my god, it smells so bad. Um, <laughs> it's 20 minutes, so I'm um, gonna do 10. And I'll see how it looks then. I'll look at it in 10 minutes. And if I think it needs longer, I'll do longer. But I'm not trying to get to a blonde blonde. I'm just dying over it. So I'm not too worried about that. Like when I did my blue, I did the blue. Um, I was trying to go on top of that, but I need it later. So I don't necessarily need it too late. But I mean, when I was doing the blue, it was this was already almost out by now. But um, it's not looking too much lighter. So I'll give it 10 minutes and then if I think it needs longer, I'll let it get longer and I'll show you guys before I get in the shower. Bye. This is what my hair is looking like after about 20 minutes. It's kind of blonde, but also still purple. So I'm going to get in the shower and wash it out. And while I'm in the shower, I'm going to wash my hair like a bunch of times to try and help with the removal. So we'll be back after I'm done in the shower. So. This is why you don't blow dry curly hair, just normally, because then you get this, especially when it's short. I don't know what's happening, but obviously it worked. So um, it did take all of the dye out mainly. Um, there are pieces like closer to my roots that are still purple, but those spots um, are really close to my roots. So they're on the, the roots that I last bleached so they weren't as light as the rest of my hair like this is because it's been over processed over and over again um so it's supposed to stain or something but um if you wanted to go completely blonde you could spot bleach there um i'm just gonna do my roots with a high lift blonde real fast just to try and lift them enough because because it is basically bleach, it did lighten my roots somewhat. So if you do not want your roots lightened, even the tiniest bit, do not get it on your roots because it will, or any virgin hair, because it will lighten it. Um, I can't say it's going to lighten a lot, but it will lighten it because it basically is bleach. Um, my hair looks real frizzy and dry, but that's because I didn't condition it. Um... This is basically the texture of my hair in most ca most cases, even when I wasn't dyeing my hair a lot. My hair still had this weird dry texture, but um, that's beside the point. So, uh, it worked for purple too. So, um, if you guys like the video, please like it, subscribe, anything like that. And I will see you guys in the next one.